hi everyone in this tutorial we will continue our development and in this uh, tutorial we will print our results on our streamlit web app so here i am thinking that uh, as we have noticed uh, in the previous tutorial that uh, google is not translating 100 percent correctly so instead of printing our text in a non-editable format i will print my text on the streamlit in an editable format like uh, i will either use a text input widget or i will use a text area widget but i think text area widget will be more suitable because it allow us to input big inputs okay and i will use that and for this purpose instead of printing this text one by one in a different text input area i will uh, create a final result of the whole text and then i will uh, print that final result in a single text input area so uh, just create here a simple uh, variable okay and i will say like final final uh, underscore resu lt final result is equals to empty so this will be my empty uh, string okay and first of all uh, here i will say final final result is equals to final final result and then print and uh, then i will say text text okay so this is how i will get a final result of the whole text okay and uh, when it comes to accept uh, i will say final final result is equals to final final result uh, plus and i will say uh, unaudible okay so uh, u n uh, a u d i b l e so just check the spelling my spellings are very very bad okay so but this is how uh you can understand this thing and then uh outside this for loop okay so make sure that uh, you should create your uh, text input area widget outside this for loop because if you create it inside this it will create to maybe four or five different input widgets based on the uh, chunks which you have created here okay so make sure that you should write here outside this for loop st dot uh, txt text area okay and then uh, my label will be nothing okay so just keep this string empty but my values okay my values will be final final results okay and now let's save it okay and uh, just open the terminal new terminal and right here strelit -E streamlit and then run uh, a u d i o i d o underscore two underscore uh, txt text dot py hit enter and then and, 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 and it's running okay so we need to con uh, select our file browse file select audio sample open it it's uh, processing let's wait for a few seconds and yeah here we got our output so now user can actually edit this text as well so here is a hello this is an audio sample for testing my text to audio okay so here um, i do not have any kind of uh, spacing and here i do not have any kind of spacing so let's open this vs code and uh, here instead of adding this thing like this uh, i will add a space here as well okay so just give a blank space then plus and i will do the same process here but here i will just give a space before this unaudible text okay now let's save it and uh, let's uh, rerun this thing again and let's browse file open audio sample and wait and yeah this is our output so hello this is an audio sample for testing my text to audio converter i have made this application using stream lit okay so just convert this with with uh, something like lit lit okay and i will test it using uh, this simple idea so just right here uh, uh, s i m p l e simple uh, a u d i o i d o okay so this is how you can actually edit your text okay and then you can copy it and paste it anywhere and here i think uh, uh, one thing is still missing 
and that is we need to create here an audio widget so that user could listen to the audio file as well before editing this text so let's create here an audio widget so okay so here i will create an audio widget okay so just write here st.audio audio okay and uh, i will pass my this uh, audio here okay so just write here uh, a u d i o audio okay now let's save it again okay and uh, let's uh, rerun this thing just browse file or uh, 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 audio sample open it okay and now here we can actually listen to the audio and then after listening to the audio we can actually edit our text okay so now let's listen it hello this is an audio sample for testing my text to audio converter i have made this application using streamlit and i will test it using this audio sample and yeah everything is quite good and here as you can see we have text and you can edit this text so this is how you can actually create this audio to text converter so i hope that uh, you have enjoyed this tutorial and in the next tutorial we will see something new till that point bye bye